Hi everyone, this is a quick tutorial to show you how to go into Google Drive, open up a document, and share it with your partner and with me. All right, so first you go to Google, you sign in, use your um, student email account, okay, sign in, then you go to the little collection of squares, that's our app. Um, corner, I don't know what else to call it. Um, then you open up Drive. All right, and my Drive is a little bit messy because it is, I consider it my digital file cabinet. Okay, so you're going to create um, a new document. So you press the new button and you say Google Docs. Okay. And it creates a document that looks a lot like a Word document, okay? And the very, very first thing you have to do is you have to rename it, like really. Otherwise, you'll have 600 untitled documents and you won't know what they're all about. So you totally have to um, rename it. And so I would use the date uh, for now, unless I tell you otherwise, okay? That's one way of doing it. Okay, and and um, Google Drive saves like every few minutes. It changes. It saves all of the changes and things that you've done. It, it saves it all the time. But if you want to just make sure that stuff is getting saved, you just click up here, and it automatically gets saved. Well, anyways, you can go ahead and type uh, right on this document. Okay. Do what you need to do. It has a lot of the same features that Word has um, and some various fonts. It doesn't have a whole lot of fonts, but you know, various things. There's a place for you to do hyperlinks and insert pictures. You can do all kinds of stuff depending on what the assignment has you do. Okay, but that's not what we're talking about right now. Now we want to share it. Okay, right now I am the owner of this document and nobody can see it, okay? But I wanna share it with my partner, okay? And my partner is going to, I'm going to invite uh, one of my partners to do their own editing on it. So we don't have to be together. We can be, you know, at home editing separately as long as we have access to Google, all right? So I'm gonna say that this is my partner whoever this person is, and they can edit it along with me. I'm going to press send, and yay, it's going to go off to their email and they will have access to it very easily, okay? Well, that's great, but that's only part of it. The other part is making sure that I can see it, Mrs. Carlson, making sure that I can see the work that you've done, okay? so. Again, you're going to share it with specific people, okay? And you're gonna share it with me, all right? But instead of me being able to edit it, you're going to say that I can comment on it, all right? I don't really want to have editing powers over your document. I just wanna be able to make comments, okay? And so that's super and then you press send. You can add a message if you want that says, you know, hmm, this is Rosa from one. Okay, whatever, whatever the message is. And then you can send it to me. Click, and then it gets sent, okay? So that is how you change who sees what all right and who has access to what all right so i hope that helped and this will get you through starting a google docs